someone asked me, it's been more than one occasion, do I believe that aliens exist? My immediate answer is yes. Most of us who have grown up over the past several decades have always associated aliens with green men and flying saucers uh, whizzing across the skies at uh, speeds faster than light in a cylindrical or saucer type uh, vehicle or spacecraft as it were from another planet big bug eyes and so forth and then when you watch the uh, science fiction movies you see their so-called version of aliens a lot of it could potentially be folklore or just simply something that's conjured up in someone's uh, imagination but let's look at it from this standpoint uh, an alien to most of us is something that's not from the reality that you're in that we are in uh, in terms of another life force that's potentially more intelligent than us maybe just from a different galaxy or world my thought is this when you look at the vast world that we live in today uh, you have human beings being the highest intelligence on this planet that we are aware of then you have the animals beneath us you know elephants uh, whales alligators tigers mammals if you will the fowls of the air all varying species and so forth and then you have uh, aquatic life the fish and the uh, life in the sea the uh, rivers the lakes streams and so forth and then you have your insects what we call insect world and then you have your much smaller life so you have your smaller life forms uh, down to microscopic living creatures as well so if we live on this planet and then we look at all of the things that's been put in place for all of the life forms on this planet to exist it had to be some intelligence there to put it all together we don't have the capacity to create anything down here because what's here on earth has been here before we were ever here so there has to be something greater than humanity that put humanity here on this planet and all other living things and to also put all of the resources on this planet for us to exist and even coexist so with that said if there's some greater intelligence and some power in existence that brought us here put us here placed us here and put the planets in the sky in the solar system as it were the stars to include our own Sun and moon why would there not be life somewhere else how can we assume that there's not life or could not potentially be life somewhere else somewhere else so why haven't we seen it who's to say that man has not experienced an alien force it is said that our government has some hidden secrets that they have not disclosed openly to the general public I'm sure you've heard of I think it's area 51 many many years ago but I'm not going to be the dead horse I don't really care my point is this just because you don't see it doesn't mean that it doesn't exist just because it has not or they have not revealed themselves to us openly maybe we're not intelligent enough to deal with them maybe they're just so far beyond us in terms of intelligence that we are petty human beings down here and we have nothing to do with them and they go about their lives as they do so I do believe that aliens do exist and I leave it open for that just because we don't see it we didn't see the Sun placed in the sky but it's there 
Hello. And then we benefit from it as well. The moon is in the sky as the lesser light in the evening or the nighttime. We benefit from that as well. All of the things again that we need for our existence on this planet is here and we didn't put it here. So I conclude aliens could potentially exist or maybe even do exist just by virtue of the miracle that we are here what we are today that was it what do you think <laughs>